Keys in another room. Grab them so we can get the hell out of here. Still not sure about leaving him like this. He came through mm -hmm. with the truck just mm -hmm. like we asked. Mm -hmm. Even greased his partner to make it look good. Mm -hmm. You got doubts? Mm -hmm. I'll well, take the chance. Mm -hmm. You should get going. You got the keys so you can drive. Come on, let's get the hell out of here. Oh. Need to get a move on. Let's go. Take it easy here in the town. We don't need the cops crawling up our asses. Well, if they freed me from this prison, if that railroad... The old man wanted us to keep one of the guards alive, help throw the feds off the trail. Like you said, I'll take a chance. Besides, if I learn anything from being over in Nam, if someone's willing to flip sides once, you're probably willing to do it a second time. I'll fuck you in the process. So answer me this. What's the craziest thing you saw over there? You don't want to know. Hell, man, I'm a taxpayer. I got the right to know how my money's being spent. Oh, Georgie Marcano pays taxes. Damn right I do. That's how they got Al Capone. And I ain't going to prison for no fucking tax bill. Huh? Are you going to answer the question or what? We, uh... We on the coast of Quang Nai. Evacuating the civvies for Charlie overran everything. Anyway, we getting them onto a medical ship. And this woman walks up. She's got a baby in one hand and the leash to a pig in the other. She starts up the ramp and the MP stops her and tells her, you can only bring one thing on board. So she tosses the baby into the water. MP goes ape, tells someone dive in after the kid, starts screaming at the woman, wants to know what the fuck she's thinking. You know what she says, dude? She says, I can always have another baby. Jesus fucking Christ. Hey man, you ask. <laughs> yeah, but I thought you were going to tell me a story about some Goop getting his dick blown off or something. I mean, God damn. It's not a fault. But not like you think. The conditions over there, man. Jesus Christ. One day you're raising cattle, tending your rice. 
Next day, everything bombs flat. You put people up against the wall, they will do anything to survive. That better have been one delicious fucking pig. Guards at the reserve probably won't be too keen on you waltzing around with that piece of yours. I'll just leave it under the seat. Time to see if these forged IDs are worth a fuck. Back it up to the loading dock. Some of these fellas might get a little uh, rough with the language and... Well, I ain't like I've never been called nigger before. I know, but I'm just saying, if I go along with it, ain't nothing personal. The only thing I care about is getting our hands on that money. When I say something about being hot, that's when we make our move. All right. Where the hell you going, Lincoln? <laughs> 